right, guys, we're out here on the Ohio River in the Indiana, Kentucky zone. And um, we just got one, which you've seen that. And uh, we're going to move out a little bit further on out. We're going to just kind of fish some wood type of areas. And uh, we're going to try to get out of some of this. We, we got a whole lot of debris out here, and we're in the perfect little zone, you know what I mean, where it's just hitting us left and right so we're just gonna kind of go out a little bit probably down some we're gonna kind of fish some edges and some trees and mud and uh probably some creek mouths today also maybe even a barge cellar too see what happens Dad's gonna let me catch one while he's uh, catching tree fish again. He's got two tree fish. I got me a tree fish on my other rod though. I'm not too, I'm not too jealous. <laughs> That fish on my special lure. Yeah, well, I got one right here. Let's get this one. Let's see how to tie a knot while you're catching that. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that one? <laughs> that was uh, Let me show you how I tie Let me show you how I tie this knot here. Finding a couple fish here and there so far. I kind of moved on out, found some more. I found a tree on a uh, hump, but there's some other wood down in there. Lots of so debris. We moved from 13 foot down to where it drops from uh, 17 on to 27 as it staggers on through. youngster, but I'll take him for my first fish for the day. Give me a nice little fight. Always happy to catch a fish. Might not have mentioned, but we did catch some fresh shad. Wasn't real hard to get the shad, but it took a minute. This fish does have mud all over his sides. It means that he's kind of holding on a little bit, you know. Oh, that's in there. Darn. I'm gonna hit that green and orange color pity call. Get nice first fish for the day. Happy with that. Let's see if we can get another. Let him go. We, uh, we went on out some more. Found a big hump, real big wide hump. All the water around it is 30 foot. 
and uh, the hump comes up 24. It's got wood all over it. Had a handful of fish scattered in there. So we just got bait scattered all around it and on top of it and behind it. This fish came from on top of it. We're just trying to give each spot 15 to 20 minutes, something like that. It's working on this one right here. He's a swimmer, though. Not like the other one. Might be a couple pounds bigger. It's all right. Catching fish in January. Love the color of these blue cats in the muddy water. They get real nice and pale and pretty blue. Yeah. Hey, he's smaller than that other one. It's a little youngster. He's got mud on him. I don't want to show you his tail. He's pretty though. Let's let him go. He's old too. Nice. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we do need to stay right here. So far, we're getting fish on each anchor, just one. Actually, we got a second one on right now. First fish was a nice one, probably 21 pounds. He was up close. Right at the end of the feels steam. Like, feels like a decent fish. Yeah. Watch the line. You see it. Maybe I need to see this one. Wants to come up this way. We're strong. We're in the current. Bad fish. And there we go. Got Not a bad on. fish there. Where'd the pliers go? Probably under your gloves. Hit it nicely though. I'll give him that. His tail rolling around, acting stupid. We got us a little, little straggler there.
It's a monster baby. chunk chunk piece I hurry up and get this one back in the water it's just a baby face thing it's it's job go This fish heard me talk about dying to move. I'm dying to get out of here, and then all of a sudden, three of them go. I'm still gonna move, though. This will come off of a big pile of trees. There was a lot of fish staged up behind it. not really active so try to find another pile of trees or something oh we have channel cat yep channel cat definitely time to move grab a big bait pulled it unfortunately there we go there's a nice little fish let him go perfect size eating fish on the back of that camera it'll light it'll turn on to where you can see okay, he's in that other line so I can't tell how big he really is he's a strong fish no matter what Gigantic, but definitely better than what I've been landing. And just in that other line. Oh. Big belly. 
no mud. He's out on the rampage. So let him go and get my tangly mess up. See what happens. side of the creek mouth. So the creek mounts, I think it drops down originally around 70 foot, somewhere in there, but uh, just kind of scan the, the edge of it. As it staggers on up, there was fish all over it. Fish all over the top side of it also, and a few down in it, so. We decided we would fish. I think we've been in the water three minutes. just kind of calmed down on us so, so that's good. More or less we're not even really fishing in the hole itself but uh, the edge of the hole as it staggers down and some of the top of it guys that's what we're after we are looking for a big one but we got a nice one in the beginning let's let this little guy go see if we can get some more seem to be catching fish on every anchor today so that's a big plus in my book happy with that we don't even have that much on there so. Good. <laughs> probably just put him right in it. That's all right. I don't care. It's bound to happen when you got a thousand rods out right now. So this one hit further out. I'll put it way over. Little chunk, middle section. Try to weasel him through these other two rods. Get lucky. It's a pre barge bite. Got a barge coming right now. Little wild guy. Happy to have him though.
anchor. Fish or two on every anchor today. Can't beat that for January. There's too many days I've been out in the too many days I've been out in the warm. Ow, nicer weather. Oh, fish. Conditions perfect, you know, and uh, not catch anything. Or just one. Right in the corner of that mouth. What's in there? Oh, that stuff's gonna hit that. Another fish, he's mad. Throwing his tail up. What's that? I'm gonna go home. Nice. Wanted to go home. I like catching fish. Alright guys, we're gonna end it here. All the rods are up, so we ain't gonna get no extra fish. But I'll tell you what, it wasn't a bad day. We got a fish or two or so on each spot. Every anchor was a fish. So can't ask for too much more on a January, uh, see it's uh, January 11th and it's four o'clock. So it's time to go. Please hit that thumbs up. Leave all the comments you want. We'll get back to you. And uh, if this is your kind of thing, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Subscribing is free. I'm just going to say that because some people think that you got to pay to subscribe. It's not. And it really helped my channel out quite a bit. Thanks again. Appreciate you.